Hello, everybody. Well, we just got back from looking at an ambulance that I think we've decided to get that. Uh, supposed to pick it up Friday, but then, like, again, you know, if it's not exactly, if they didn't fix what we need it fixed, then we don't want to get it. But we did get that. We did. Uh, we plan to go get that Friday. And, uh, yeah, the back part, the, the, the motor is great. It's a diesel. It's got, it's a 2008. It, everything works good on it. The box part of the ambulance, I'm definitely going to do some painting on it because it's crappy. It does have some work that needs to be done inside on the back which is not bad that's not bad and of course I've got where I could come across from the back to the front um, now what I'm going to see about is how if I can get these tags on my van transferred over to that um, because there's nothing but a box van basically that's what it is so I'm going to see if I could do that inside except for the fact that it was dirty um i looked at it i could see where i can have a bed at um and it's got a lot of counters and it's got the sliding doors so that you can put food and it's got glass it's really it's very good it's i won't even have to have any tubs inside like i have to here and I already figured out where I'm going to put my stove and put a sink in. So we're going to go get it Friday. And hopefully, hopefully, it, they'll have it ready for us. But I'm not even going to tell you how much it is right now. <laughs> I won't because it, it's a godsend. So I'm not going to tell you how much it is. <laughs> Later on, after I get everything ready on it, I will. But I will take pictures of the before and the after. That's for you to understand. I will do that this time. Um, it needs a good cleaning and good bleaching. Boy, does it have to be bleached. Uh, but I think it's going to be good. Especially, it's a diesel and I think on the highway, it's going to be a lot better. And I will get better gas mileage on the highway as well. Um, so anyway, that's what we've been doing this morning. Um, oh, my goodness. <laughs> it's, it's really quite a... Uh, it's kind of exciting in a sense because everything is already built in also when you consider there's insulation so I don't even have to put insulation in they've got insulation in it um, you know it, it's it, it would be really good I'm, I'm like I said I'm not crazy about the box part of it because it needs a good painting. And I'm going to do just a temporary paint on it. Um, and then when I do have money to throw away, <laughs> I will go someplace and have them paint it. You know, just do a good paint job on it. Um, but right now, I think, I think it's going to work out. I mean, motor transmission is great, so... That's the main thing. Brakes are good. That's the main thing. So, we'll see. Um, I will probably end up donating this to somebody. Because when God blesses me, I would need to bless back. I really do. We're still looking for another one for Noah. Which we will be able to do. Um... I'll get Noah, we get, I'll get, <laughs> Noah will get one similar to it, but, uh, yeah, it's going to work out fine. 
um, I'm really, I, I'm kind of excited about it. I, I'm excited, but yet I'm like, ah, ah, you know, it's changing vehicles that kind of gets me. But for the price that this one is going to be, I, I, I can't beat it. Cannot beat it. So, anyway, we will, uh, we will be heading out probably towards the end of May, the beginning of June, something like that. Of course, again, this all depends on whether I can just over online have my tags from Arizona transferred over to this be other vehicle um i'm going to call them later on or probably tomorrow and find out if that can be done um because you own your tags in arizona when you buy the tags you own it so there's a possibility i don't know um but that would really help a lot otherwise i'll have to get like a 30-day temporary tags and drive on and it's going to, we'd have to go it'll take more time between now and the time than June if I do it that way so the best thing to do is if I could get it transferred over um, I can go ahead and I'm on my way <laughs> we're heading back out the nomadic lifestyle which I love so much um, somebody asked me what happened about the boat okay I have said it before in other videos but I'll repeat it again I thought very very much about my age areas that we would be on possibilities of storms and the more I thought about it, the more I said, all right, you are wanting to live a dream that you've had all your life when you were younger. But remember how old you are now. You're 77. Do you really think this is the best thing? And I made a decision for myself, which Noah agreed with me, um, to just not do it. I'm going to miss it because I had so many plans and visions of it, but you have to think logically, not just because this is something you want, but you got to think about everything, your age, this, what can happen, blah, 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 blah. And I think on land is better for my fur babies too. Um, and somebody asked me something also. Are you the one that makes the decisions to do things you're going to do? Because you're always talking about you. Well, when I say me, yes, I'm telling you. Because I'm talking, this is my channel. Not Noah's channel, it's my channel. But yes, Noah and I do discuss what we're going to do, what, where we want to go, and how we're going to do it. We discuss it, and we make a decision from that discussion so no it's it's a decision that we both make to do what we're going to do okay all right peace love you all air hugs till tomorrow